Hey everybody, I'm celebrity interior designer Derek Curtis and welcome to my home. All right, I'm so excited because this room used to be our guest room. And if you know anything about me and my family, my husband Jason and I just recently had a baby and we realized we need more space and we need more rooms to do more things. So I'm excited because you guys get to come along on this journey with me as I take this room from a blank canvas to one that's gonna be really perfectly suited to a family with evolving needs. And then along the way, I'm gonna give you my top design hacks. And then at the very end, I have a perfect secret for how to merge the worlds of art, tech, and entertainment in a room. Stay tuned. I say the biggest challenge that we have to keep in mind is that we're working with a finite amount of space. The space really dictates um, where things go. The room was designed and one wall there's a door and that leads out to our backyard. There's another wall that has two windows on it, which really leaves the only space for your bed to be between the two naturally. Any type of seating should go on the wall between the two windows. And the room is really dictating that. And then opposite the bed, the only other natural place for you to have a television would be opposite the bed wall. So we're working with those challenges and the room being small um, and really you having to work within its existing framework. While we're here, this is my best kept secret. You have to stay tuned to see exactly what it is. You're gonna love it. I think more than me. No, you're not gonna love it. I'm gonna love it. You're gonna love it too. Other than that, I'd say with a small room, um, if you take if you pick a really big, bold, deep color, and deep meaning dark, um, it tends to shrink the room. So we didn't want to do that, and so the room dictated that we also should select a color that was light enough for the room to feel open. You know, and we want a room to feel open, especially if we're talking about you know a, a young child being in the room. So for me, um, the things that I use when I'm designing a room um, vary. I would have samples. Just so you can bring all of those elements in a really small way on the table and put them near each other so that you know if they work or not. And, and also, you need to pick the thing that matters most in the room to design around. So yeah, choose one thing, design around that. I love art. I collect art with Jason. We have a, a beautiful collection. We tend to gravitate toward art that, that gives us a feeling. Um, it could be mixed media, it can be um, abstract art, um, it can be portraiture. We just love artwork that really does something to us, you know? So, yeah, we love art. There's a ton of ways that you can pull art into your space, and um, I can't wait to show you a little bit of that later. you guys you ready you sure all right come on in without further ado the final room take a look around take it all in take it all in a lot has happened but here we are and this is it and I'm so excited to show you my secret hat the thing I am most in love with today take a look and feast your eyes on the Samsung frame TV right isn't it gorgeous? You see how thin it is and how it sits really flush to the wall? That's like one of my favorite parts. One of my favorite parts because there are tons of things that are my favorite about this TV. The, the other thing that I really love about it is not only right now it comes with this really sleek and chic bezel that's black, but it has tons of options. So if you don't want a black bezel, you can change it. It can be white, it can be brown tons and tons and tons of customization. If I designed a room that was all black and I wanted the bezel to be white, there's an option for that. I'm gonna show you how easy it is to put it on. Take a look at this. And now we have this beautiful gallery wall with a very different bezel on the piece of art. And then, not only that, I already have this set on one piece of art that I thought really just feels right in the room. And with the click of a button, I'm in art mode and I'm setting a photo that I really think 
feels really good on this gallery wall I created. Another photo of Arrow. Look at that. Isn't it beautiful? The Frame TV really does merge perfectly the worlds of art, entertainment, and technology in a way I've never seen. And it's really just the thing that I'm really most excited about. And I think all of my clients are going to be really excited about it too. I think you should be really excited about it too. Alright, thanks for joining me on the redesign of my family room. I'm Adair Curtis, interior designer, and this is my art and design field world powered by the Samsung Frame TV.